Hello, my name is James Crane and I have a video response to David Picciuto's wrap-up review this week. He was asked how to get more involved in woodworking while living in a condo. His answer of using hand tools is a very good answer, but not all people are suited to hand tools or small projects. The first thing for any woodworker to do is find other woodworkers in their area. Clubs and societies are good for this, but the best way is to go to the local lumber store for that particular type of project. Second, meet up with as many of those people as you can. Ask them if you can hang out with them for an evening or for a day. Be prepared to work and do whatever they ask. Shadow as many people as you can and learn a wide range of perspectives. Many woodworkers don't mind a little help every once in a while and you'll get to work on a lot more complicated projects than you would be able to on your own. Thirdly, find a shop that's willing to share. Instead of rent, trade help or some other servants. For example, if you're an accountant, they may need some bookkeeping done. Most trades should be approximately on a one-to-one -one ratio. So, for example, if you spend a day in the shop, you should be prepared to spend a day helping out. Shops are expensive to maintain and you don't want to overstay your welcome. Thirdly, you should have a great little chest of your own tools. Most woodworkers don't mind if you borrow the table saw, but have your own marking and measuring tools as well as drills and router. Also, probably have your own blades and bits if you can. Good luck and have fun.